Okay, in this tutorial we're going to go over arrays. So go ahead and open up your app here, and we'll get started with this tutorial. Okay, so first we're going to explain what an array is. An array is like a variable, except an array can hold multiple values, instead of just holding one value, like a, a variable. So instead of having to declare three variables to hold three numbers, you can declare one array holding three numbers. So to declare an array, you go int, whatever type of variable you want to declare, and you type a box, like so. That tells it that's an array, that it's an array, int, the name of the array, numbers, and then a semicolon. Okay, so now you've declared an int, told it that it's an array, int, and the name. Okay, so now we go numbers, equal new, int, and another box. But instead of just doing this, we have to fill in the information of how many values you want it to hold. So if we type in 3, now it can hold 3 values in this new int array. Okay, so now this array holds 3 different variables. So to assign the variables, we can go numbers, and then we type the box, and now we have to, we have to use the value, what value, what part of numbers do we want to change the value? Well, we want to change the first value, right? We'll see an array starts at 0, not 1. So the first value, which is 0, can equal 1. And then the second value, which would be 1, can equal 2. It's pretty confusing at first, but after you start to use it, they're very easy to understand and uh, very useful. Okay, so now I've, we've declared a new int that holds three values. The first value, right here, equals 1. The second value, 2. And the third value, 3. Okay, so this is, the, this is the part of the array we want to change, and this is the value. So it starts at 0, 1, 2. See, we have three different values, and that's as many as it'll hold. So we can just go ahead and, if you want to write uh, one of the arrays, on the console window, we can use this from console.write line, and then we go numbers, which is the array name, and then we put in the array part that we want to print. So we can just print, uh, we're going to print, we're going to try to print this one. So we print numbers, and then which part of the array we're going to print, which is one, semicolon, and then console.rekey, and press debug. And as you can see, we print 2 because we're trying to get 2 out of the array. Okay, that's a basic tutorial on arrays. Uh, for more information on how to make double arrays and string arrays and different ways to fill, up, um, fill the values of arrays without having to type each one of the values like this, um, there's a text tutorial on Coder Island that I will provide the link to in the description.